Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a How to Get Your Grades Part 2. All the stuff down for this one and sorry. So, um, I, my first tip is to... Okay, I can't read this. Oh, keep the papers that your teacher gives to you. Okay, so I have um, a notebook for each class that I need a notebook for at first. My notebook for um, math this is the only notebook that looks like this, but in the front, it has pockets. There's a ton of pockets in this one, but um, basically in these pockets and this one, I put like my homework, my study guides and stuff like that, and then the one in the back, I put my um, like older stuff that my teachers give back to me, my like grades and stuff, and older study guides so that I can study them for like the nine weeks test and the semester, um, year exam. So that's a good tip to keep your old papers. You don't have to leave them in your notebook at school, but you can leave them at home. It's a good tip. Take notes. I know some teachers, it's like, oh, it's optional to take notes. Take notes anyway. Like, I was in um, science, and he said, you need to know this. And everything he said, you need to know, I copied and pasted it onto a document. And that's what I'm going to study. Um, it's just a good thing to take notes, even if we don't have to take notes. It's just a good idea, too. So, you have something to correct your answers whenever our teacher goes over a test. Obviously, your teacher is going over a test for a reason. Um, I know I used to, like, last year, whenever teacher was going over chat, I was like, mm-hmm, why are you going over this? No one even cares, but correcting them is going to help later in the future, and, yeah. My next tip, and actually adding this on, it wasn't on there, but, is to, like, study the stuff that you've already learned. It's going to help you, because, like, whenever an exam's coming, shoot, there's an exam coming, I have to study at the last minute. Well, you have already been studying the last one year not last year but at the since way before they told you it's gonna help you um i don't know then if you listen because like until studies we did a test today and half the stuff it wasn't even in our notes or in our study guide and like half the stuff he told us so if you listen he's going or she your teacher is going to probably say stuff that's if you have computers or laptops at my school we have chromebooks listen do not listen to music unless your teacher gives you permission and it's only at like, your time like you're taking notes like off of something or you're taking a test if they let you listen to music and stay on where you need to be um because if you're just on like playing games and your teacher is talking and giving you notes you're just playing games you're not gonna learn anything it's not a good idea you go to school for a reason you can do that at home if you heard that that was my sister she flushed the toilet i think but um yeah, just listen. Do not be on places that you do not need to be. Study for tests. This is like the biggest obvious one. Like studying is obviously going to help you. Um, yeah, ju just study for your test. Some people are like, oh yeah, I don't study. I don't study like a hundred. Study anyway because you never know when that test comes that you don't have to, that you can't really study for. You just have to know. I guess. No, no, you never know when that test is going to come that um, you don't study for and you're going to make an S on it, so study anyway. Use Quizlet. Quizlet is an awesome site. I'll link it in the down bar. Um, basically, you can make flashcards, and I make flashcards on at the last minute, and it helps me learn so much. So using Quizlet is an awesome tip, and it helps me so much. So again, Quizlet will be in the down bar. My last tip is to not fake being sick. I know, like, I don't want to go to school. I'm sick. <laughs> don't do that because you're going to miss what you've learned and you're going to catch up and it's going to take a long time. And honestly, there's no point of faking. There's no point of faking to be sick. If you guys have any more tips on how to keep good grades and stay up on Leave them in the comments down below and help other people who watch this video. And don't forget to subscribe. And I make videos on this channel. My vlog channel. I'm probably going to make for videos. Make videos every Friday, I think. And on my main channel, I make videos Wednesdays and Sundays. So subscribe to both of those channels. They will be, or subscribe to this channel and my main channel. They will be, all my stuff will be linked in the number on my social media site. So if you guys want to contact me, you can message me or you can message me on Twitter or Instagram. 
Don't want to message me on Twitter because I'm probably not going to be on it unless like, I get an email or a few times, I probably won't. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys later. Bye!